they're starting to add up in one particular area, which would be consistent with a person or persons starting fires. Bryant firefighters say numerous grass fires over the last month or so could have been intentionally set. Thanks for joining us tonight at 10. I'm Ashley Katz. Well, good evening. I'm Bob Clausen. There have been about a dozen fires since late January, and they're getting bigger because safety matters. Bryant firefighters now asking everyone to be on high alert. Care for us, Mitch McCoy in the studio with a look at where these fires are happening. Mitch, what did you find out? Well, Bob and Ashley, good evening. The fires seem to be concentrated along about a mile stretch of Highway 5, and most of them are happening in the afternoon. The city's fire chief says no homes or businesses have been damaged, but it came too close for comfort today. They say grass is greener on the other side. I didn't know what had happened. But in Bryant, some scenes are black grass. I stopped right here when I pulled in this morning and looked at it, and I thought, well, what happened? First Baptist Church pastor Philip Miller has a hard time believing someone could have intentionally did this. I don't understand vandalism, period. And so I, I don't know why somebody would do that. Since January 27th, Bryant firefighters have responded to about a dozen grass fires, most of them happening in the afternoon, and all of them in about a mile and a half stretch along Highway 5. It's beginning to seem more like a, a pattern for sure. Bryant Fire Chief J.P. Jordan says the fires have been relatively small, but Tuesday's fire is different. Anywhere from a four by four area on the ground, four foot by four foot, to today, the one we had today, uh, was an acre. Bryant firefighters say this is the biggest fire yet, coming right up to the side of the road and about 50 feet on the other side of this tree line are homes. Chief Jordan says it's too soon to know if someone for sure is setting the flames, but there are too many things in common with each of the fires. It's becoming more and more uh, in the back of my mind that uh, an individual may be out uh, doing that. While the sun reflects off charred grass, Pastor Miller says it will come back more vibrant. The grass will be greener this, this summer, but I would hate for anybody to ever light a fire to our building or to someone else's home. The Bryan Fire Department is asking homeowners and businesses to check their surveillance cameras if they live in that stretch of Highway 5 for anything that sticks out or if they see anyone suspicious. Ashley. All right, Mitch, thanks very much. And officials are reiterating tonight, if you see something, say something. Police ask everyone to be vigilant and to be on the lookout for anything suspicious. You can give Bryant Police a call or 911. We have more information for how you can contact authorities on our website, krk.com.